My name is Brian Pillman Jr. and you're watching Dre41 Gaming. Now I'm a little partial to this gaming channel because 41 is my magic number. It was my number in football and it was my father's football number. So you can bet that Brian Pillman Jr. is going to be tuning in to Dre41 Gaming only on YouTube. What's up, y'all? It is your boy, Drake41, a.k.a. Mr. 4K, a.k.a. El Fuego, Spicy Drake. And welcome to another episode of WWE 2K22 My Rise. Somehow we're on the second floor of the NXT building looking over the skyline of, of Orlando, which is very strange. All right, so we got two people to talk to. Let's talk to uh, William Regal, uh, you know, leader of the Blackpool Combat Club. <laughs> If you haven't already heard, the NXT Breakout Tournament is right around the corner. This year, it's open to NXT and NXT UK superstars who've never received an NXT title opportunity, which means you're eligible. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. What does the winner get? Some buns. <laughs> Confident one, are we? The winner will earn a championship match of their choice at NXT TakeOver. So, are you interested in participating? Absolutely. I'm in. This is the opportunity I've been waiting for. I'm in. It's two title showtime. All right. Good luck. Appreciate it. All right. Let's get to it. All right. We about to get to it. I'm about to win this damn tournament, man. I'm not really worried about who the hell else is in it. Because I'm going to smoke their boots regardless. It ain't even about to be no situation where they about to come through and dust my boots off. I'll be damned. Which is funny because you see these episodes every Friday, but I literally record these in bunches. So I, it's been a minute since I've played, but I should be okay. I, I should be all right. Um, it shouldn't be too much of an issue. Damn, it's a good looking attire. I can't even stun. It looks like I got beat up a lot because I got the, the knee brace, that thick ass knee brace, and the big elbow pad, but it's fine. I'm not even going to trip off it. You know what I'm saying? This is just for my rise. It's not like I can use this attire outside of my rise, which is stupid as hell. You shouldn't have to create another wrestler. You should be able to import a wrestler that you made outside of the game mode. I don't even know, like, what made them want to do that? Like, oh my god, like, yo, real talk, this, all this stuff that they're doing that I feel like could be fixed is ideas that I'm bringing to the wrestling code team. <laughs> So it's like, it's whatever, honestly, at this point. Because it's just like, you can't keep asking one developer to fix this, fix this, fix this, when there's other developers out there in, in, the, in the yonder, in the wild, who can basically fix or, or, or you know, one up on the mistakes of one developer. You feel me? Like, you can easily, you know, not easily, I'm not making it seem like it's just something to throw together. But you know, you could create a story mode, with, you know, with branch and storylines or whatever the case is, but just implementing little features that are, you know, that people would appreciate. Because it's like, most people, and me, me included, I create myself outside of the, this game mode because in my mind, I thought, oh, okay, you could probably import. You feel me? Which would make sense. Why wouldn't you be able to import your character? Hell no. So you got to create him all over again. And then not only that, not only do you have to create him over, you don't have as many logo spaces for your My Rise character, which makes no sense. No sense at all. So it's like, let's say you wanted to create like a CM Punk. You can't do that because they don't have enough logo space for that to even happen. Whatever. It is what it is. Let's get it. Yup. I'm a, I am so buns. Yup. All right, I'm going to stop. <laughs> I'm going to stop now. Get off me, sir. Come here. Hold this. Really? Oh, I'm about to say. I better not just have a damn body slam. That, that looks sus. Come here. Hold this. Mm. I don't even know jo Joaquin. Joaquin Wild. Remember when he uh, broke that dude neck at Impact Wrestling? Mm. That's the clothesline Dre was looking for. Get on your feet, soldier. Come here. Alright. Let's go that way. Full head of steam. Lariato! Yeah. I ought to put some DLC moves on him, too. I can't forget about that. I cannot forget about some DLC moves. Oh damn. Burning hammer. 
Why he still got his chain on? He wrestled with a chain on? I don't think he wrestles with a chain on. I've seen a couple of his... Well, I watch NXT damn near every week. It's good that, you know, they're in a storyline. Like, it's, it's really good. Um, You know, the mob versus, you know, the... I, well, what, what would you call it? Like, it's the Italian mob versus what? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? The Mexican mafia? I don't know. I don't know. What would you call it? What would you say? It's a little little bit on the nose there, but it, it's fine. At least they ain't fighting over drugs. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Let me go up top. We're going to go up top. We're going to do high-risk maneuver. High-risk Dre in the building. Yeah! High-risk Dre in the building. Yeah. Yo, Joaquin is getting his boots schmiddy. Mm. On your feet. He getting his boots schmiddy. I'm doing him the filthiest. Yeah, hold that. Get on your feet. I'm beating fire out this man. Hey, there is nothing for him out in these streets. Just paying. Yeah, German. All right, let me. All right, got my sig. How the hell do I do my sig again? What is it? Square or X? I'm sorry. Oh, what the? Damn! How do you how do you drag a mother? I don't even know how. Whatever. I don't even care at this point. Like they changed the control so damn much, yo. Like I don't even care anymore at this point. All right, better not be rope break. There we go. One, two, three. Washed him. Easy. Say less. I didn't even come out with my championship. Wait a minute. I, wait, wait a minute, where's my where's my North American Championship? Oh, see what they doing to me, y'all? See what they doing to me, y'all? It's cool. We ain't, gonna, we ain't gonna worry about it. On to the next one. Uh oh, first round, I got the W. I was robbed. No, you got washed. <laughs> you got washed, sir. Don't even sit there and play yourself like you about that life, bro. You got washed, good brother. So I guess we stand in each other's way of making it to the finals? Uh, no, you stand in my way of making it to the finals? Yeah, looks that way. Who would have thought after all our battles at the PC we'd be facing each other again with so much on the line? And you're going to definitely let me win, so I will compliment you because I'm a babyface. I saw how talented you were at the PC, so I'm not surprised. But I want you to know that even though we respect each other, I'm not going to take it easy on you. I want this title opportunity more than anything. Right. Absolutely. I feel the same way. So may the best man win. May the best Showtime win. And only one of us is named Showtime. Yeah, boy. Me and, me and the homie about to go one-on-one. -on -one. You know, we went to Mexico, handled some business with family. He owe me a favor. I should finger poke a doom him. He had to like, he, he don't remember. I helped him with against his father and and a dude impersonating him in Mexico. All right, we ain't gonna we ain't gonna talk about that though. Shoot, that's all right though. That's all right though. I remember. That's where I got that chain from. The cartel helped me. <laughs> they got rid of the body. <laughs> yeah, that knee brace looks wild, bro. It was like I got my boots smoked. Like somebody worked my damn leg to death. I think I might change. Nah, I'm gonna keep it. I, I like I said, I'm not really stressing how I look in this mode. As long as I look presentable, I don't look like some. Like in earlier episodes, I ain't gonna stop. I look, I look sus. I'm not even gonna stop. But I think I got a good look right now. I think I look good. This is this is. I mean, the character Showtime has evolved so much, yo. It's like I can't even. Like I just know. Base, base, his base, his original base was a mixture of The Rock, um, Triple H, and Hayabusa kind of put together. With a little bit of like 70s disco sort of thing. Because when I originally created this character, I had braids, right? And <laughs> I used to take my hair out and have an afro. So I would have an afro. This is WWF attitude, okay? So I had an afro. And I had like 70s sideburns. So my character wasn't like a 70s kind of style, but it kind of was. And I kind of, I, I don't know, I kind of molded myself in between Triple H and The Rock. Like I had the, the flashy moves like The Rock, 
and I had the technical prowess of Triple H. You feel me? And I was just like a cocky, arrogant, and this is my, my character, just like a cocky, arrogant, you know what I'm saying, just self-centered, 70s kind of talking, like wrestler. That, that was the original Showtime, and it was Mr. Showtime. And it was just like, after a couple of years, it's like, yeah, I can't really use Mr. Mr. just, I don't know. <laughs> Mr. just doesn't work right. Let's see if this clothesline from hell works, though. You son of a bitch. Um, sir. Um, you thought. Bring that ass here, boy. Yeah, that German suplex is so slow, bro. It is so slow. Come here. Oh, this. Big Jermaine. Damage Hector with attacks. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, this Larry Diato better count as two. There we go. That's what I like to see. It better not be no nonsense cutscene that pop up, yo. It better not, yo. Because now I was talking about do damage when it's like... I was going to do damage regardless. So now I'm a little bit... I don't know. It looked like some nonsense going to happen out in these streets. And I don't like not... Are you serious? Are you serious? Sir. Sir. Hold that. Hold that. Joe ass in the corner. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at those combination punches. Gotta love it. Joe ass down. Punk. You stunned yet? Hit him! There we go. Good old-fashioned chop block. That's what the families came to see. The kids love it. <laughs> ah, hold that. Show ass up. How you do strong strikes? I don't even know anymore. Ah. Nah, sir. Yeah. Back up. Yeah. You bitch. Come here. How dare you block? How dare you no sell um, uh, my tried and true clothesline from hell? Hold that. Alright, now what other nonsense they got me doing? Hit Hector with a standing strike in the ring. Oh my god, here we go. Here we go. Let the nonsense begin. I know I just didn't do... Oh my god, I just know I just didn't do that roly-poly nonsense. Oh, the ref bump? Ref bump? God, these ref... These zebras are paper. Wet paper. These zebras are so trash. I love it. I love it. Just hit me. There we go. Mm-hmm. Yep, over the back. See, I knew... I, I knew it. I knew I knew some nonsense was going to happen. Go ahead, go for the pen. Go for the... Yep, you're going to do it. Go for the pen. See see how life life comes at you fast? You see this nonsense I got to go through? Do you see this? This is nonsense. And I knew it. What you going to do? That nonsensical frog splash. That's the first move he did to me. And I took an L. I love it. I love it. Thank you. No, no, seriously, thank you. And and you took the pen, you bastard. Flores is I'm 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 yeah, I'm gonna hurt him. I'm gonna hurt both of them. I'm gonna hurt both of them. Nah, don't act like you surprised. You in cahoots with them. You from Mexico, they're Mexican faction. Y'all in cahoots. Don't mm -mm, mm -mm, all y'all gonna get the same. I'm poking everybody. I'm getting the flicking shine. Yeah, this this the nonsense I'm talking about. I love it though. I love it. Yeah. Yeah, somebody getting attacked from behind. I'm hitting him with a car. Oh, just a forearm? Come on. Come on. Close line. Close line. Okay. Okay, try to do a move to me. Um. Oh, shoot. He got me. He got me with that one. Damn, that one did some damage. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Nah, sir. Yeah, you bit. I'm walking away. I'm tired of you, motherfucker. What's wrong with you? Huh? Damn, you can pick up the chair a little bit slower. Oh, that stupid. Yeah. Mm hmm. Get that ass up. Yeah. You gonna get this ass whooping? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Come here. Uh, how dare you? How dare you? I'ma beat his ass. 
Ooh, this ass whooping. I'm going to lay down on you. Come on, get up. Showtime. Showtime. Come on now. We don't got time for this. What the fuck? What the fuck? How? You piece of... Yeah. You what? Bruh. Bruh. Yo. This is the nonsense I'm talking about right now. This should not be happening to your boy. Joke. Joaquin Wild should not be serving me like this. Oh my god. I'm going to. Yo. I'm going to. Yo. If he got kids, they're going to be orphans. That's 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 the type of time I'm on. If, they, if he got kids, they're orphans. Bring your ass here. Stupid. Get on your feet. Now I'm going to beat your ass. Now I'm going to beat your ass. Punk ass going to sit there and make me lose like I'm some extra regular old man. Get your ass up there, stupid. Yeah, get up. I know it hurt. I know it hurt. Come here. You're going to get work, though. you definitely going to get work, with your stupid ass. Get up. You beat fire out you. You don't even know. You don't even know. You don't even know the ass whooping you got coming. Brain Buster, there we go. Him dead. Him dead. Him downstairs. Get your ass up, stupid. Get over there. Beat your ass. What is this? Stupid ass table. What is this? What is this table? There we go. Get your dumb ass on that table. Oh, we in the, 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 the interview area? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Remember when people were sitting there all happy because they seen that little dumb ass elevator sign? Remember that? Oh, you're going to with multiple floors. No, you can't. Shut up. Oh, that stupid. Now I'm in your life. Now I'm in your life. Come here. Hope your kids watching. Where's security at? Where 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 the backstage folk at? They not here? They don't want to see this? Come here. Stupid. Hold that. Dumbass. Don't you ever. Don't you What the fuck? Oh! Oh, he acting different. He acting different. This is not you. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Come here. Yeah, big clothesline. I'm gonna kill him dead. He don't even know. Come here. Come here. Uh-huh. Blue Thunder. He's not dead. Wow. He gonna be now. He gonna be now. Come here. Joaquin on the chair. Yeah. Him dead. Him downstairs. Oh, what they gotta say now. We still not even, but that felt good. Ah. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. What are, what are we about to do? A takeover magic? Why? He's so lame. Nobody, congrats to tournament winner, uh, that should, whatever, you, I'm going to be babyface, whatever, uh, whatever, uh, oh boy, we at takeover, we're at takeover, goodness, I should have had a championship match, but no, I got to sit there and be in the opening contest, <laughs> I got to be in the curtain jerker, because we got to, we got to get, Joaquin Wild in a, in a higher position on the card. Former uh, North American champion in the opening contest. Look how look how quickly I fell down the card. I was sitting there beefing with, with Killer Cross and, and 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 Punishment Martinez, and now look at me, Joaquin Wild. This this is who I'm going up in. Joaquin Joe Quinn. <laughs> Walk, walk, Joaquin. <laughs> Dumbass name. That's Zima Ion. <laughs> it's, I'm, I'm fighting Zima Ion. <laughs> His first name is non-alcoholic non -alcoholic beer. Zima. DJ Z. Oh, my God. This gimmick was so trash. Not the trash is gimmick. And, and isn't he, like, Filipino or something? No, he's, um, yeah. Zima Ion is, like, Filipino, pretending to be Mexican. That's racist. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. I need to stop. I need to stop. But no, nah, hold on. He's not Mexican. He's not.
Legado del Fantasma. He's not Mexican. Is he? He might be, like, partially. Which, you know, whatever. But he's Filipino, isn't he? He's from the Philippines, right? Or, I don't know. He got, like, I don't know. It's, it's fine, honestly. Like, don't think about it too much. I'm going to beat his ass, though. He's in a suit. Great that it's all black, so now he's already dressed for his own funeral. So I'm going to work him. Like, he don't even know I'm going to work him. I, no, I got to wrestle this dude twice. Like, who is he? He's nobody. Like, come on, bro. You could have got somebody better in NXT for me to beef with rather than this clown shoes. This clothes. Are... You know, they, they're learning too much. <laughs> the computer learns. They understand me too well. They know. There we go. No, oh, that didn't. There we go. Big forearm shot. We'd love to see it. I'm going to work him. I'm going to beat him up. I'm going to beat this man up. Falcon Arrow. Yeah. Joe Quinn. Joaquin. Come here. There we go. Get in there. Yeah, big farm shop. Lariato. Take your head. Smooth off. Look at this zebra. Shouldn't he have an NXT shirt on? Don't referees have like NXT have like NXT specific shirts? Or no? Am I tripping? I'm pretty sure they do. And they should have updated it to NXT 2.0. <laughs> Where's Braun? Where's Braun Breaker? It's funny, I was actually um, considering, not considering, I was actually gonna make her again. Um, I was actually gonna make Caden Carter to go with Casey Katzenzato, but I changed my mind. I was like, nah, I'm not gonna do it. Well, not on my main account. Maybe on my secondary account, I'll give her a shot. Cause she got a lot of tattoos and I gotta draw the tattoos over um, because reasons. It would, bro. Seriously, you son of a bitch. All right, you got one off on me. Good for you. I was trying to escape, sir, and you touched me. Damn, you can't drag me. You bum ass. Get out of here, bro. You ain't about to sit there and win up. That's what we doing. Nope. You thought. Bring that ass here, boy. <laughs> <laughs> you love to see it. Mm. Come here. Love that DDT. Love that DDT. He tried to springboard me. He tried to. He tried to put me out. He tried to take me out the game, Coach. Hold on. Oh, this your ass now. This your ass now. Yeah, yeah. Come here. Two punches. Yeah. That's it. That's all you get. You don't even get a finish. You don't even get a finish, you bum ass. Punk. Take that blue thunder bomb and call it a day, sucker. That's what he gets. That's what he gets. Trying to act like he tough. He gets a sig. That's all you get, punk. Alright. We have finished the storyline of the breakout tournament. Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Stay safe. Catch you on the next episode. Later.